Johnson, we're coming for you. that for World Superbikes. I died in part 2018. Um, I didn't really vlog much going on because there were so many people and it was just so warm. So I just kind of vlogged um, the races, but whew, it's a hot one today. Whew. Actually, slightly too warm. Slightly too warm. I thought I'd just quickly let you guys in on why I didn't really vlog much but that's why there was a lot of kids around and I don't really like vlogging in public because of the whole kid factor and there was just too many kids so I just didn't vlog so I just vlogged the races and um, we also went like right next to um, the East Midland Airport so that's where you can hear a lot of um, planes in the background because it's literally like a landing strip here I think my mother has walked the wrong way. I've now lost my mother. <laughs> mother, mother dearest. Actually, what? Woman, what? Just uh, filmed a few races. And um, we're now on our way home. We've been here since like 10 o'clock this morning. It's been a long one. <laughs> Where is she? Mother? Hello, hi, it is the morning after World Superbikes. Uh, basically, I didn't vlog anything else because being in the sun for that long gave me the worst headache ever. So basically, when we got home, I passed the fuck out and didn't wake up till 10 o'clock this morning. So, with that being said, I've just done my makeup. I'm not doing anything on the eyes because I just can't be bothered to stick lashes on or do mascara or anything like that. I just can't be bothered. So this is how we're looking. I am looking hella cute right now with my hair all messy. I'm in my 90s club um, jumper. I still have foundation on me from like the last time I wore this. I swear to God, I washed this. <sighs> Swear to God. While I'm still looking rather ratchet and my voice is about to go, I still need to have breakfast. That is why I'm feeling sick as of right now. Um, Megan's coming around on Thursday. Um, don't know if we're gonna have, I don't know if we're gonna do anything because, <laughs> because I was editing Friday night. I was editing a video. I'm not gonna say what video, I'm, it's a video that was a collaboration with Megan. Didn't exactly turn out the way I would like it to turn out because the lighting just it just didn't really work. I just wasn't as much as I edited it, it just I wasn't vibing it. So that's been scrapped. So we're going to have to film again. Otherwise I have no collab to go out. <laughs> um so we're probably going to end up doing that and filming a few more videos. Um I don't know. I don't know. But she is coming around Thursday, so we're going to be filming. We're probably going to end up chatting again, having lunch. Maybe go out for lunch. I don't know. It depends on the weather. If the weather's nice in England, hell, we might even go outside. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe even go for a little walk. Maybe show you around this town that I live in. I don't know. It's half term. There's loads of kids out, so I probably won't do that. Because realistically, that was the reason why I didn't vlog much at Donington Park because I could have easily walked around vlogging and stuff but there were so many kids not necessarily kids out of like teenage years but kids like under the age of five 
that are running around and screaming and like if I'm trying to vlog I'm gonna like walk into them or I'm gonna catch them in the background I just feel bad if I was to catch a kid in the background so that was the reason why I didn't vlog as much purely because I just don't want to get anybody's kids on camera I just don't want to do that I don't want to put their kid or themselves in that position so I tried to avoid people's faces a lot does that make sense does that make sense Hello, it is now Wednesday morning. I am looking super cute with my greasy hair. Let's, let's just put myself into the bus there. Um, I've just literally woke up like 10, 20 minutes ago. Hence why the hair's like a wee bit messy, but I will get in the shower today. Don't you worry. But today, Megan is coming around tomorrow. So I just need to like clean my room and stuff because I've been lazy all week and just not really not really done anything except for go to the gym every morning and that is literally about it. <laughs> Let's be real. So I ba basically it's just going to be like a pyjama day I think today. Because say my pyjamas, I'm in my um oh hair, Pfft, hair issues. Um, I'm just in my raccoon uh, dressing gown and some pajamas so i think it's just gonna be a pajama day and clean your room kind of day but i will still show you what i'm eating so i'm now it's what quarter to 11 quarter to 11 bit of a later start today as well we had the maddest thunderstorm earlier as well at like five o'clock in the morning it woke me up it was so loud i haven't heard anything like it in like a month of sundays it was so loud ridiculously loud like i woke up i was like shit <laughs> So, yeah, anyway, I'm going to make myself something to eat, breakfast-wise, probably smoothie, and some, like, granola or something like that. And then, yeah, like I said, today is a bit of a pyjama day, um, cleaning, sorting things out. I've got a pile of washing that I need to put away for sure as well, which I did yesterday. So, yeah, I'm going to do that, and I'll, uh, oh, didn't put it all the way down. And, yeah. I will show you my breakfast. So for today's breakfast, we just have this like granola chocolatey situation. This is Asda's own because I couldn't find the one that I normally have. So we have this with my almond milk as always. And for today's juice of choice, hello sunshine, that is what we need right now. Just not the humidity. Um, but for my juice, we have this uh, Trop Tropicana Essentials Vitamin Power. Um, it basically has uh, orange, apple, pineapple, mango, carrot, and guava juice in. This is actually really, really nice. <laughs> While cleaning my room, I have come across my Leavers book diary from high school um i don't know if this is a thing in like other countries i know in like america you do like the whole like prom thing and grad ball and stuff like that after high school but in the uk back when i left high school we had like little notebooks that you would write little messages in from like your peers and your teachers like saying like your well wishes and good looks and all that and i've come across mine mine just had like little strawberries on um so i thought why not go through some of them i honestly have not read this or even looked through it since the day i probably left to be fair so there's things in here that i don't honestly even remember this could get juicy this could get juicy so and also just ignore the fact that there's gonna be cars driving by apparently and the fact that i'm breaking out just just ignore that if i had full face of makeup on i would feel a lot more less conscious of how i look but it's a pajama day so i'm not gonna put makeup on Dear Jess, you are an amazing form buddy and friend. We have so we have so many good memories to to remember from form. We will miss playing Jenga. We will always we will all miss you, mostly me, Vicky. I'm not gonna say surnames because I don't want you like stalking people. That's a bit weird. To my form and maths peer, we were in the same form and we were in the same maths class for two or three years. Um. I wish you good luck for the future, not that you need it. I'm going to miss our random conversations that don't actually have any meaning. Very true. Still very relevant. <laughs> miss you and good luck, Abby. 
like I said, me and Abby, we still talk, we still see each other, so nothing too different there. Oh, the filter on that one. <laughs> Never read a handwriting, and I sure as hell I'm not going to be able to read it today, but we will try. I might need Google Translate. Okay, to Jess, I have known you since year seven, when we were in, when we had some crazy times in Dr. Mix form. From walking into doors... <clears throat> And other things, you have always been a good friend and always known how to make me laugh. Hopefully one day... Oh no. Hopefully one day as we... What? Set... Oh, hopefully one day as we said we will travel the world, lol. And find out that Russia isn't separated in half. <laughs> I remember this conversation, oh my god. Gonna miss you loads, Sarah. Oh my days. I actually remember having this conversation. Yes, where do I start? I have known you for ages. We have had so many good times together when you come round and had half of the Pringles. Yeah, I was a bit of a, um, been on legs, shall we say. When we did, when we did the Jess and Gerald show, 2011, where we did YouTube. Well, I did YouTube, she just got the stars. Snowball fights, messing around in human physiology, lol. Oh, yes, I remember that class very well. Thank you so much. <laughs> Going to miss you, lads. Good luck in the future. Love, Gemma. P.S. Like a big plane. Epic. Keep on singing. Like a big plane. I don't get that. Like, the keep on singing bit, I get. Um, she now actually lives around the corner from me, and I still haven't seen her in, like, months. <laughs> Gemma. You live around the corner from me. We need to meet up. <laughs> and then this is, like, her second letter situation. It's kind of like similar, but a little bit like more long-winded. Dear Jess, where do I start? I love getting to know you over the years. I think we have grown closer over the last two. I would be sad when we leave. I am so happy I got to know you. You are funny, always there for me. We have a laugh mostly every day. And I can talk to you about anything and you have been there for me. I remember teasing Sarah about Bootman and when we were uptown looking at Fruit and Veg Boy. Oh my freaking days we had code names for boys that we fancied bootman ended up being someone that i was on the same course with in college and fruit and fresh guy I, I haven't seen you in like years honestly i remember the snowball fight you me and my brother had you got scared and got a towel and put it over your face her brother was lethal that's all i'm gonna say <laughs> i've always loved your hyperness if that's even a word you are so hyper and you are fun to be around. I remember our trips like the JLS concert. Oh, wow. Wow. Singing along, taking pictures and having a laugh. That day will be one I remember for a long time. Same. I remember all the good times we had. I will truly miss you and I will never forget you and all the good times we had. We always have a laugh about anything really. Thank you so much for being there for me through the tough times and happy times. I have loved getting to know you over the years at Glee's. Thank you for being my friend. Good luck in the future and, and in anything you do. Miss you loads, love from Jem. So this one is from my human physiology teacher. Basically in high school I was a swimmer, at, a competitive swimmer at that and he had always had this joke against me that 90% of chlorinated pools is piss. Hence why there's chlorine in pools to stop bacteria because kids pee in pools. Swimmers pee in swimming pools. I'm not even going to deny that. But this is like the chemistry symbol situation for urea, which is in urine. I learnt something. Um, but he was like, no, no, oh my god. Oh no, I've just seen what it said. Nice to know that you spend your time immersed in at least one aspect of science. Best of luck in the big world, Mr. Perry. Honestly, he was probably like one of my favourite teachers, honestly. But this is from the notorious Emma. Yo, dude. Hi. <laughs> I love our random days out, our random picnics, our random listening to old songs, everything really. Still true, we still do that. I'm going to miss you. I'm going to miss you, although... Oh, all those what? <laughs> I'm gonna miss you all those, but it's not really goodbye because I'm gonna see you in summer and I'm stuck with you for the next two years because we went to college. Plus, we're gonna travel the world together too, remember? Why has that not happened? It's been like four years. Why has that not happened yet? <laughs> I'm, I'm your financial manager. Why did, why did she say that? Why did she say that? Oh, because I think it was because I was singing on YouTube at this point. I don't even... 
Emma, why are you my financial manager? Good luck in your exams and in the future and see you and see you at sixth form college. Hope you don't miss me too much. <laughs> Love Emma. Mate, I'll probably saw you the day after you wrote that, to be fair. So this is what I have for lunch. It's not looking very appetizing, but I've just cut up some mini scotch eggs. We've got some potato salad. We have some coleslaw here. Under all of this cheese, there is some tomato and basil pasta with peppers. And obviously a mountain of cheese. So that is what I have for lunch. Hello, welcome back. It is now a Thursday morning. It's 11 o'clock. I have just filmed a video requiring my phone, requiring a song, and that's all I'm saying. <laughs> that's all I'm saying because that video will be coming out in a few weeks' time. So I've just finished recording that. Megan is on her way. Well, I say she's on her way. She's on her way via an interview situation so she will be here around 12 one o'clock so until then i'm gonna make myself something to eat i am going to start editing this video that i have just filmed and we shall see each other again when megan's here i told you i'm with megan <laughs> <laughs> basically i pranked her earlier i'm now editing said prank you're uploading something i'm transferring stuff from phone to laptop and then i'm gonna find a wiki I don't know either. Um, <laughs> I, I want to get a video of your reaction to the new Sims sex mod. Okay. Like you have Are we filming it. that today then? We can do. Cool. But yeah, we're yes. just going to be here looking like students all over again. Um, I actually look like a student with my dress. Yeah, from like the 60s. <laughs> Honestly, from like the 60s. So we're just going to be here doing this shit and then we're going to record something. I just need a scrunchie in my hair, or a bow, and then I would be like something from the 60s. Yeah, you need like white ribbon or something. Yes, yes, yes. But we've just, I don't even know what we've just filmed, we've filmed something. You're very close to my face as well, but realistically, I'm getting a dead arm, <laughs> so uh, deal with it. Um, what's the plan? Weren't we going to do that drawing one? Yeah, I've got paper for that. Um. I mean, we have, like, a list of things that we could do, but we're not going to do all of them because realistically we just haven't got the time or energy or time to do them. Um, I'm liking my makeup right now. I mean, I was. I like this highlight, though. Oh. The glitter on my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> that was, like, ultimate uh But yeah, we are going to film a few more videos. I've got my ring light on, hence why we have like amazing lighting. Thank you so much. <laughs> um, so yeah, we are going to put our laptops away and then we're just going to film. Realistically, I think I said that we wasn't going to be that entertaining. I think. I mean, I don't know. Like, this one's quite entertaining at times, but... This one's like hyper today because she's actually off work. Yeah, the pair are quite hyper, but yeah. We're going to film. Hello. When your ring light is as tall as your friend. <laughs> it is actually. The issues of a midget. Wait, you can like push it up as well, can't you? Yeah. The ring light is taller than your friend. <laughs> it comes to something when everything is taller than you. For example. I'm on tiptoes. <laughs> and I'm crouched. <laughs> <laughs> so we've just finished recording a video for my channel. We've done something for her cha channel. Um, <laughs> don't know. She's about to take her makeup off and we're about to do something. What was that? <laughs> what was that? <laughs> the ring light's still on, that's why you're having a bit I'm of a like. I'm so hyper, flare. it's unreal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we are like ridiculously hyper. Ridiculously hyper. I so, probably be like this every week. <laughs> it's just one last weeks to be fair guys it's just one last weeks um but next week we are meeting oh i've got hair stuck to my face we're meeting up thursday That's... and friday yeah next week so a double dosage of this twit uh, <laughs> oh, thanks. but yeah you're gonna take your makeup off we're gonna set up are we using my makeup or your makeup either i haven't brought loads with me we shall see <laughs> tonight you just want So that is basically the end of the day with Megan. You can probably see her in the background. Um, it's 25 to 5. 
we've got a little bit of Charlie Puth on. Megan's uh, new best friend. <laughs> it's on, it's honestly like a long funny story, but you and Charlie, you and uh, Charlie Puth, the friend, the man, the myth, the legend, and all. <laughs> <laughs> um, we are both hyperactive as well. My makeup will be coming off as soon as she leaves as well. Um, I've just done her makeup, hence the really like blue raccoon eyes. But <laughs> not that you can see because she's got glasses on. But yeah, I've done that to her face. We have we're on a time constricting. Con we were time restricted. Construct first trip. Whatever. <laughs> English is not my forte. Yeah, we know. Um, so yeah. This is gonna be the last of her. That looks really good on you to be fair. I quite like it. I like the blue on you. It suits you. I think it's because I've got really dark eyes. Yeah, I have like hazel eyes. But I've got like all brown. I've gone brown today. My nudge is brown. <laughs> I don't know what my hand's doing here, like... <laughs> okay then. <laughs> right. <laughs> she hates me, she honestly hates me. But this is going to be the end of the vlog as well. This is the first time I'm ending the vlog with hair all over my face. Nothing normal out of the usual there. But with Megan! So, this is going to be the end of the vlog. If you like this vlog, probably not. Click the like button anyway. She's got a coat on. Um, <laughs> like, comment, subscribe. Her things, with, her social media will be linked down below. It's been a long week, a long day. Yeah. <laughs> I will see you in the next vlog video situation. Bye.